This is Lawrence Fletcher, hedge fund correspondent at Reuters, talking to Tom Caddick, portfolio manager at LV Asset Management. Tom, can you tell me how your um, equity holdings are positioned at the moment? Yeah, sure. Um, we've been underway for some time. I mean, to be fair, we've been underway since launch equity, as you know. Um, but we have increased that underweight over the past month, month and a half. Um, we are still have a marginal overweight US, marginal overweight Asia Pacific, otherwise we're underweight. We've shifted from an overweight last year, Japan, to a current position of, of underweight by about one and a half, two percent Japan. Likewise, Europe, we moved from a broadly neutral to marginally overweight to an underweight now in Europe. UK, we've been underweight throughout. We've actually marginally reduced that underweight to about one percent underweight now. Um, emerging markets has remained a marginal position in our portfolios from day one and remains a significant underweight. Right. Okay. And um, you're, you're quite keen on investment grade corporate bonds at yeah. the moment. Um, can you say sort of how you're positioned and why you're particularly keen on those? Yeah, sure. Um, across the portfolios, we have an overweight investment grade. Um, the drivers remain the same, the differentials change on, across the portfolios, depending on what our neutral position might otherwise be. But if I address you know, um, balanced and stock market as the two standouts, we've got a significant overweight of around the 45% investment grade. We've gone, as I've said before, we've gone for experience, we've gone large. Um, i.e. the players who are getting most visibility in the new issue market. Um, our take on that has been that default rates, if you strip out the anomalies of, of financials, the default rates do not look realistic. Um, the, on a total return basis over the coming 18 months, the returns look attractive, extremely attractive, to be fair, certainly against cash. Now, I appreciate that the risk profile is significantly different to cash, but uh, the characteristics do remain attractive. The concern is that this is becoming something of a crowded trade. Um, it's clearly been talked up uh, by basically anyone who cared to listen at the moment, um, and we are mindful of that. But on a total return basis over the next 18 months, it does look attractive. On the managed portfolios that we run, where there is a neutral weighting, um, demand for property, commercial property. We've actually, um, to an extent, I'll say paired off, clearly it's not a fair trade, uh, we've paired off a significant underweight in commercial property against a significant overweight in investment grade, uh, corporate bonds, and credit. Um, largely on the belief, in the belief that um, there is greater visibility of a positive total return on investment grade over commercial property where actually that should be late cycle moving out so I can see continued downside on that. Right. Great. Thank you very much. Okay.